tropical rainforests are going to be looking at the structure of tropical rainforests and reasons for that high biodiversity. Tropical rainforests are found around the equator, perfect conditions for high biodiversity. The blue bars represent the high precipitation and the high temperatures are represented by the line, which is about 27 degrees, degrees all year round. Four layers to the tropical rainforest. The first is the forest floor, which receives very little sunlight. After the forest floor, we get the understory or the under canopy, which receives some more sunlight, and you find lianas here and tall trunks growing straight up to the sunshine. Upper canopy or canopy layer is where there's most dense vegetation and animal life found, and the tallest trees that get the most sunshine are in the emergent layer. Ultra high biodiversity, lots of plants, lots of animals, over 50% of the world's biodiversity. Now, this is a K pop tree that has adapted to grow really, really tall in the emergence layer uh, and it's withstand the extreme conditions of constant sunlight from the overhead sun and heavy precipitation. They've also developed drip tip leaves with a waxy cuticle to ensure that water runs off as quickly as possible. Next slide. And joking, here is a huge tree and the, uh, a huge leaf, and these leaves can actually move like satellites with the sunlight. And again, they're extra dark green to ensure, with more chlorophyll to ensure that photosynthesis can take place. Next is buttress roots. Not only are these buttress roots really wide to give the tall tree stability, they've also got a large surface area to ensure rapid exchange of gases involved in photosynthesis, carbon dioxide. And oxygen. Lianas grow up the trees and they're like roots in the air and that's because the soil is very infertile, they can get more nutrients from the air. Epiphytes are plants that live on other trees. In terms of animals, this is a toucan, adapted well to the rainforest. It's got bright colours on its beak to attract female toucans and also this strong large beak is a honeycomb structure which means it's very strong but also lightweight. Another animal that's adapted well to the rainforest is the jaguar. Its uh, jaw is so strong it can crush a turtle's skull, which makes it great as it's a predator. And also it's got strong legs and sharp claws for climbing up trees. 